Alright folks, welcome to the channel Skins for Life for even a hack, please burgundy and gold now. After viewing the comments on my last video, and after actually looking at my last video, I honestly feel that not a lot of people knew where I was coming from when I said what I said about the gameplay feeling the same as last year and how I was disappointed that it does feel the same as last year. I stick by this statement by the way. Um, I am disappointed because the developers finally did something that players have been doing for the last six, seven years with any EA football game, and that's adjusting the settings. Basically, that's all they did. Yes, it's in the programming, but slider sets have been coming out since. Um, since they've added sliders in these games and in this case with NCAA 11 last year at factory settings had a lot of suction blocking, a lot of suction tackling there was force fields all this was, was there compare the factory settings of NCAA 11 to the factory settings of NCAA 12 yes the guys that disagree with the video are right. It is vastly improved. It definitely feels different if you compare factory versus factory. But I'm comparing uh, adjusted settings versus factory settings for this year, and they play, and it plays completely the same. Versus put out a slider set suggestion uh, video a long time ago sometime last year of course after NCAA came out that took away the force fields and the suction and reduced the suction blocking and suction tackling um, in the video that I'm gonna put out next it's actually a two-part video of the gameplay you'll see maybe one instance of rocket catching uh, yeah, where the receiver all of a sudden bursts and gains that separation away from the defender and catches the ball. So you'll see one instance of that. I, overall, it was the same as last year. That's, that's basically what my critique was. Based on last year, the way I played the game according to the slider sets that Versus had put out that took away the suction blocking, suction tackling, um, and the force fields. So basically the developers got up off their ass and just adjusted the slider sets to now their slider sets that I had are now factory settings in NCAA 12. So most of the people that disagree with me didn't adjust their slider sets. They didn't fix them, they just kept their factory settings and played it the way the developers made it. So that's really not an indictment on me, that's an indictment on the developers that made the game. Now, hopefully, since one person commented that, um, that Madden needed the major overhaul and not NCAA, I agree with that. Madden definitely needed more of the overhaul than NCAA. Like I said, last year NCAA 11 was far greater than Madden 11. The Madden 11 was garbage. And, that's, and really that's where everybody is upset about. It's not really the college football game because people have been satisfied with the college game for the last few years. It's just the, the, the pro version with Madden just has sucked as of late. So now that we see the footage of Madden and how it's looking so far, that looks good. But I can't help but to sense a train wreck coming through. And yes, I talked about a train wreck in the last one. What if Madden plays the same as it did last year? What if I'm like, yeah, new camera angles, you know, presentation, they're always going to nail. But if it plays exactly the same as it did last year, and again, my standpoint, 
Some people are going to keep it at factory settings and are going to play it. But if the adjusted slider sets that, again, for Madden, according to versus slider sets, and I actually made a comment with that as well, took away the suction blocking, the suction tackling, and the force fields. If that plays the same as last year, I'm going to be pissed too. So you'll see another video and then there'll be people commenting, calling me a jackass, or not really calling me a jackass, you know, don't listen to them, you know, whatever. But when you have to adjust sliders to a game to fit your game style, then that tells you that the developers aren't doing as much as they did before. Because I remember when football games didn't have slider sets. The developers back then weren't lazy. So, like I said, I just wanted to clear that up. And, you know, folks are going to continue to disagree and agree with me. That's fine. Everybody's entitled to their opinion. 